The Appomattox community is coming together as one, helping those affected by the storm. WSLS 10's Duke Carter is live in Appomattox County tonight. So, Duke, a lot of young people are helping and volunteering, particularly the football team. Oh, yeah, from Frisco students to attend Appomattox County High School to the football players, all the young people out here are just showing their support to those who have been impacted by the storm. Uh, work, work. About 25 students on the Appomattox County High School football team are lifting heavy materials. Materials like wood or bricks that were ripped away from homes when a tornado hit Appomattox County. Complete shock. Heard about it last night. Drew Mann is helping to remove debris from his aunt's house with the help of his teammates. Yeah, that's, that's even more better, just to be with them. It was just, it's just great to see um, how our football team would come together. This is a true family right here. Family, like Mann's coach who volunteered, and he says he's glad to see his players come together in a time of need. It makes you know me feel great about them. That, that's you know last night when they knew all this stuff happened, uh, they got on the phone with each other and text and and uh, wanted to know uh, you know what they needed to do to help and count me in, coach, and I'll be there. And meanwhile, others in the community are offering their support to those who lost everything. It's just one of those things when I saw and heard about my friend. It was one of the things that really just knocks you down. You really don't know what to say. I'm just helping him out as much as I can with just being here for him and trying to get up some of this wood off of his house and try to clean up anything that can that's inside. But in the meantime, this Appomattox Raider is pushing for a brighter day. I hope for that everyone, um, we get back to Appomattox the way it used to be. Now, this isn't the first time where people in the football team, I should say, came together. The last time was for the coaches' power of one mission, and this came after a number of tragic incidents that happened at the high school. But the football team did go on to win the two-way state football championship.